For the dudes that hustle all night, hopping on anybody that's on sight. They get a nine to five, they hustling all white. Stuck in my old ways, got my own price. In summertime, everybody roll dice. Couple of young boys, they living a hard life. New Gotham, call me the Black Knight. I'm back with another one, getting the mad hype. Since I let go all of the stress, I'm out here doing me, living my best. Everybody bugging like Kanye West. White supremacy, got that man in check. Yes, I demand respect. Keep it to yourself if it's indirect. Always on point, so I stand correct. I say what I want, don't care who it affect us. Killing them, train. Go ahead, King. Killing them, train. Go ahead, King. Killing them, train. Hey, my beautiful sisters. It's your girl, Dr. Shauna, and welcome to my YouTube channel where I will be documenting my sister lock journey. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel. And when you get the little bell, hit the bell so you can be notified whenever I go live. This is the first day of me being home after my sister locks have been established and I am taking out the Bantu knots. I'm taking out the Bantu knots for two reasons. Reason number one, I've never liked Bantu knots. Yes, that's me, don't shoot me, don't get mad. That's just me, it's not my preference. And reason number two, I wanted to do a lymph check on my hair because I had my hair cut an inch, an inch and a half before I got my locks put in to take off the damaged edges and I want to see how it looked. So um, I'm really feeling it. It's not that bad, at least not in the front. I think that the lymph is really good for me. So I'm liking that. On day one, I want you to know that your locks will be a little stiff. And that is normal, that is normal. So I'm glad I took my Bantu knots down so that I can get used to it. I'm also wanting to check out the grid. So it's my understanding that if you don't got a grid, you don't have sister locks. And the grid is very, very important. This is my grid. Your girl has 405 locks in total, 105, 199 locks in the front of my head. This is what makes me part of the sister lock family. Hey, what's up with that? Nonetheless, I'm gonna show you the back of my head. You see how much scalp you can see? It's my understanding that that is the case because when they move to the back of your head, your locks get a little bit bigger and your parts get a little bit bigger. But what's most important is documenting your journey. So I'm gonna show you my scalp, see how spacey it is. And then we're gonna really look at that scalp every month that we go along with this journey to see if it gets better. Not only the lymph check, but to see how my hair fills out. I hope it fills out really good because that's a lot of space. What do you think? I think that's a lot of space. But one thing that is beautiful about that is that it's on a grid. So when my hair gets to the length and when it starts to settle a little bit more and I get to style my hair, I get to part it right along that grid to get any style I desire. I love that, I love that. Whew, I can't wait till these things grow in. But here you have it. I also want you to pay attention to these edges. Cause I have little baby locks on my edges and you're gonna see them sticking out. You see that thing there? And since my hair is stiff on day one, those edges initially are so hard to control. I've always had problems with my edges. I was somebody that if I weaved my hair, my edges would fall out. If I put braids in my hair, wore a wig, or crocheted my hair, my edges would thin and fall out. So this is really gonna take some getting used to because I cannot put any products in my hair and I have to figure out how to control these edges. The minute I think I have these things under control, they pop out. They do whatever they want to do. Styling your hair on the first day is not as easy because it's so stiff. It's so stiff. But you'll get used to it as I did. I want you to see the size of my hair, lymph check, you know, the size of my hair, and also the back of my hair so that um, when I start to document this journey, we're gonna see how much it grows and how much time. This is day one. Day one, just learning the tricks, 
getting used to the stiffness of your hair, loving yourself. I don't think it's bad. What do you guys think? I like it.